further back on the model, you can see a quite serious problem of kissing smile. This is severe, and it is probably why the horse end in a necropsy room. At this level of damage, it is basically too late. But in the light of the numerous cases that we have re-educated, there is no doubt that if the improper coordination of the rostra columbar colon causing intermittent contact of the dorsa span has been addressed earlier, the problem could have been prevented. Very often, kissing swan results from a genetic predisposition placing the dorsal spine too close, as you can see on this vertebral column. The genetic predisposition is then aggravated by training misconception, or back muscle imbalance, or both, that aggravate the problem causing intermittent contact of the dorsal spine. In all the cases that we have rehabilitated, it was a combination of thoracolumbar extension resulting from protective reflex contraction of the back muscles. This was coupled with a lateral bending issue that was often combined with a problem of inverted transversal rotation. However, the case of kissing span that we are currently re-educating does not have lateral bending problem. Nothing can be done with the fact that the dorsal span are genetically too close, as you can see on this vertebral colon. But the horse can learn the mastery of a body coordination preventing intermittent contact of the dorsal span. In fact, a close look at the dorsal span of the ver vertebra situated behind the damage one show how the problem often starts. The shape of the dorsal span plus the spinous process of the vertebra dangerously close from the dorsal spinous process of the following vertebra. At this point, the re-education can be successful. The horse can learn to avoid contraction, lateroflexion, and axial torsion that bring the dorsal span to contact. The horse's inherent nature is to be efficient and pain-free. This aspect of their mental processing helps them to understand that sustaining a precise coordination gives them efficiency and comfort. As long as the rider does not return to the riding and training misconception that create the problem, the horse can live a perfectly sound and active life. Six years ago, we re-educated a mare, which, as today, is still performing perfectly well in dressage. Usual therapies, injection, and shock wave reduce the inflammation, but do not correct the problem. Even if the close proximity of the dorsal span is there from day one, the problem of kissing span often develops later in the horse life due to training misconception, fast forward, driving heads, intense lateral bending of the neck, lateral flexion of the thoracic spine coupled with inverted rotation, heavy weight on the bit, low neck posture, etc. Our therapeutic approach commences with identifying the working attitude and or muscle imbalance causing the problem. The therapy continues, creating the body coordination that prevents accidental contact of the dorsal span. This is a one-to-one -one issue. The gymnastics have to be tailored to each individual case. There is not one or two or four exercises that are going to fix every horse's.